Right, we're back in the village copper mines here because Scarlet's arranged for some people to come and work here and it's now time to collect her payment from this guy. No more miners! No more ore! Yes, I found some miners that will join you. Thank you. Now we can start mining again. Here's a little reward for your efforts. Oh, that looked like a level up. Isn't that nice? And some copper ore. Fabulous. Just what I wanted. Let's level up. We have... How are we doing here? Lots of skill points to spend, but no trainer to spend them with. And I've got a map to look at here. I think the legendary map is here. Um, I'm not convinced about how legendary it is, but we'll go and check where the legendary map is. So that's there. It's in that bit. Okay, well, let's, let's go and see. I don't actually expect it to be terribly legendary. But anyway, whilst I'm running through the mind, let's talk about what happened last episode. Scarlet is still poisoned, and her plan to get herself cured by hunting down the African princess has been foiled by said princess fleeing back to Africa after kidnapping Leon. Whilst Scarlet managed to rescue Leon, the ungrateful little brat sod it off. He basically said Scarlet and the net of the mask were rubbish and he had new, more powerful friends. Um, I suspect these new, more powerful friends are Victor and crew, so that's not going to go at all well. Um, I, I hope he doesn't get turned into an undead and I have to fight him, because that would be a bit sad. Although, to be honest, his snot folks, little brat, kind of deserves it. Maybe we'll have a redemption option instead. I could live with that. Right, we're nearly at the legendary treasure point. So to get to the legendary treasure we want a shovel. Which we're gonna put here. I'm going to check my map. Let's go to Southern Bay. Right, so that's we need to go down a bit. Working around here. Treasure found. Plate mail, balanced long sword. Okay, so I've already got plate mail. Oh, that was, so that would have been good early on. Um, hmm. Well, okay. Balanced long sword. Now this is nice. The sword is nice. So it looks like these treasures are actually worthwhile. Our next step is to head back out, which we're going to do, just run round there and do it. Uh, report our findings from the forest hut to the net of the mask. The findings we discovered are that um, the guy in the forest hut had been gloated at by Victor before he died. Um, and he's responsible for Sophistos having been captured. Right, here we are. Newly arrived back in Venice, about to go speak to Eris at the Nest of Mark. Hopefully she'll be able to either tell me how to follow the princess or some more information about the whole Sophistos Black Book business. I'm also going to go and speak to the guy on the bed to see what that's about. Maybe something's changed. Have you made any progress in your mission? I have news from the man in the forest hut. Amazing. Please, take this as a sign of my appreciation. Now, let's have a look at this. What can this be? Victor used the nodes, the contact points between this world and the afterlife. And he even... No, that's impossible. He found a node in a country far away. 
and brought it here? To Venice? No, right into this mansion. What a disgrace. How could he remove this sacred object? What did he do? And what do these numbers mean? He who read no books reads the first book. He who read the first book reads the fourth book. He who read the fourth book reads the third book. And he who read the third book peeks at the first book. Is that a riddle? Can you make any sense of it? Even I can't get my mind around it. Right, well, that settles it. The time has come to put a stop to this. Well, that sounds like a number puzzle to me. Oh, books. Let's go and bother books. Let's go book bothering. Here's a library. No, I don't know. Oh, shut up. Ha! Look, I can push books. So if we go and run around the books, second book, first book, second book, third book, fourth book. Oh, that looks good! Third book. Haha! Ha, secret door! That's my room. I want to go to this new room here because I'm clever. Ah! Whoa, 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 what's that? Trees and something. Oh, someone's been keeping herself busy. This time you found me. I'm as amazed as you are. You're growing so much stronger each day. One day, you'll need me no more. Don't say that. Maybe there's something you can do with this. And what's my new power? Oh no, it's a thing, not a power. Or is it a power? So, this is what's been haunting us all these years. One of the most sacred artifacts in existence, brought here from a faraway place. He must have taken it from Constantinople. I will see to it that it is returned to them at once, to seal the tear in the fabric of our world. To you I am most grateful. You've lifted a dangerous curse. Now the net of the mask can again become what it once was, a place of knowledge. Good. Knowledge is good. Let's see what this ring I got does. Nice. Automatically. Mental energy. Our order will be forever grateful. I want to learn necromancy skills. Right, we've got a bit more time in the twilight world. Might be useful. I'm not really too bothered about the actual... That power. 
they are not going to release me. For then I will tell my master that they work against him. I... But they cannot kill me either, for I am already dead. Please, I... I've heard things about you. I've heard of your powers. Release my soul. Give me peace. Maybe later. I will wait a little longer then. Hmm. Still don't know what to do about him. I mean, obviously the net of the mask. I mean, Victor knows the net is working against him. Got no more quests for Mavis. Huh, what now?